Jason Eichelberger here, PrepCalTrack.com, with our CIF Southern Section Division II champion, Sadie Eaglehart, Ventura High School, 17-12 here today. Uh, a fabulous, fabulous effort, Sadie. Congratulations. Uh, if you could, the mindset going into this, obviously, we're at the point in the season now where it's about executing and making sure that you follow a race plan successfully, and you did that here without, without merit. Uh, just talk a little bit about what you were able to do coming into this race, what you wanted to do, and where you had to attack on this course. Yeah, obviously this season I haven't really raced a whole lot, so we're kind of taking every race um, a little harder than I would to just qualify. Um, so yeah, just going into every race with that mindset. Um, and obviously uh, it's a little difficult at Mount Sac, but um, I think I learned a lot from last week, and even though it was colder, um, it was a little warmer today. Uh, I think I did well with the conditions um, I was in, and then I also developed a head cold like throughout the past week because I haven't been sick enough. I mean, um, so yeah, just a little taxing on my lungs. But overall, um, I think it was good with yeah, like I said, the circumstances. I from a mental standpoint, obviously when you come in, maybe not feeling the greatest and having to struggle with that, how do you kind of push that that kind of stuff aside and, and do what you need to do in order to have a successful showing here today? Yeah, I think a lot of it um, comes from the support from my team and just the fact that we all really want to go to state and um, I just want to do the best for my team to get that number one spot so we can just lower that score. Um, as much as we can, so it really pushed me through today. Obviously, you kind of look ahead now, and obviously the state meet, a, a, a big deal and a big race there, but a different challenge than maybe running at Mount Sac, a different course and different attack points. Uh, as you kind of look ahead to that, what do you feel is going to be the key in order for you to have a successful showing there? Yeah, I mean, obviously, you, like you said, it is different um, than here. I think it's a lot faster. Um, but yeah, I think just staying mentally strong throughout that race, um, and really pushing myself, um, even if uh, I am doing it alone or if I'm doing it with people, it doesn't really change the mindset. That's kind of where I'm at. Obviously, for you, it's, it's about winning, and you know a lot is expected of you. A lot of expectations come from when you do well, and you've definitely earned that. Um, how are you putting those aside to get ready for that challenge? Putting aside all these lofty expectations, people expect you know records and things of that nature. But for you, how do you put all that aside and just go out and execute? Right. Yeah. I mean, as much as I would like to put it aside, it is still there. But I feel like it's just motivation and. Uh, I do have high expectations for myself, and it looks like a lot of other people have high expectations for me as well. So, um, yeah, obviously keeping those in mind, wanting to achieve everything, um, but not being too hard on yourself if you don't. So. Please take this week, get healthy. Uh, Sadie Englehart, our Southern Section Division II uh, champion, 17-12 here today for 2022. Sadie, congratulations, and uh, we'll see you next weekend at Woodward Park in Fresno. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.